listen to me. No. You are not thinking straight. Let me go. Let me go. Not until you calm down. If you keep carrying on like this, you're going to hurt yourself. That's what she wants. You're helping her. And you're wrong. I am on your side. Look at me. Can't you see that? I believe you. Not your sister. I want to help you. I don't know how she found out about that cave, but I promise you I had nothing to do with it. I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. You don't know whom to trust. If you don't want to go to the police station, we won't. It was just a suggestion, obviously one that you're not ready for. No police. No police. J just forgive me for upsetting you. That's the last thing in the world I want to do. I'm really tired. You're emotionally drained. Would you maybe make me some warm milk or, or cocoa? Of course. Sometimes it helps me sleep. I understand. I'll be right back. I was going through Janet's things. I'd, uh, I've been putting it off. And uh, I just couldn't face it, you know. Huh? And then I decided I really just wanted to get it over with. And anyway, uh, Haley offered to help me. And then when I read this letter, I was so stunned. Haley saw my reaction. She grabbed it from me. You let her see this. She does not believe any of it, Trevor. Well, I don't want to believe it either, but I got a sinking feeling. What are you doing? I've got to get some answers. Yeah, this is Detective uh, Trevor Dolan from Pine Valley. My sister, uh, Arlene Vaughn, is an inmate there. I need to speak to her immediately. It's an emergency. Don't give me any static about this, pal. You're talking to an officer of the law. Put her on the horn now. Oh, Brooke! Family, you said I should come by. About the party. Oh, yes. Uh, but Trevor's here. Oh, well, bad timing. I can come back. It's... Oh, no, 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 please don't go. But you said he's here. Well, actually, there's, there's a, a really big mess brewing. It involves Adam. Maybe you could help. Uh, yeah, sure. Please, come in. Sure. Well, you know, well, if you don't have the authority, let me talk to the warden. Go find him. Yes, I'll wait. Damn bureaucrats. I'm going to get to the bottom of this. I got, I got to go up and, and break into Arlene's cell tonight. What's going on? Well, I was going through Jan's things and I found a letter. Yeah, a letter that uh, Janet wrote to your ex. That, that Janet wrote to Adam? Um, why, is it, why is it here? I... Oh, well, apparently she just never mailed it. That she claims in the letter that Adam is Haley's father. Talk about loco. We never knew how loco. Damn, Warden, where the hell is he? Does Haley know about this letter? Trevor, hang up. Well, what do you know about this bull? It's not bull. Adam is Haley's father. So you're gonna tell me what's eating you, or do I sit here and guess? It's nothing. Yeah, right. It's life, okay? It stinks. Mm-hmm. So, you want to talk about it? No. Might help. Brian, I said no. Okay. Then what do you want to talk about? Do we have to talk? Let's just do something. Something fun. You got something in mind? Well, we... Haven't wowed them out on the dance floor lately. Mm, yeah, well, you know, my ankle's not really ready for the lombada. I thought it was all better. It is. It is. It's just not 100%. I got an idea. What? How about a little bowling? You can lug around a 30-pound bowling ball, but you're not up for dancing. Yeah, come no, on. Oh. It's always good for a few laughs. For you, right. Look, why don't we just go to a movie or something, race around, anything. I just don't want to talk or think or be serious, okay? 